Please don't tell me that I look like the kind of girl who's obsessed with the size of her pores and the delicate placement of her hair. I'm sorry, Kiki. Like, I really am. I don't know what else I can say. Sorry to start. Groveling's better. A burger and fries would probably tip me over the edge of forgiveness. And I bet if he bought me a milkshake, we'd probably forget what we were fighting over in the first place. Yeah, you could learn some valuable lessons from me. Like socialism, self-loathing, anarchy. Just pick and choose. I'm a veritable buffet of stigmas. You're just an egotistical psychopath. Actually, I've been diagnosed with paranoid schizophrenia, with a side order of non-delusional disorder. But so kind of you to hypothesize. I'll get the fuck out of here so I can contemplate suicide in peace. Two-time state champ with one year left to go. Pretty impressive. I'm just that good. And Colin was about to take you off your throne and you didn't like that. My father didn't like that. I couldn't care less. If it were up to me, I'd go join the Peace Corps or go live in Manhattan or something. I didn't kill Colin. It wasn't me. And if it was up to me, I'd go live somewhere else out of this city and out of this stupid goddamn town. <laughs> 